Recording. Double D. I think I prefer the quick connect. Never mind. That's the job. Okay. Phone check. Gloves. Glasses. Boom. <laughs> Brand new helmet, brand new Senna 10C Evo, wife, oh fuck that's slippery, put the phone in here, hopefully I can still control the phone while it's in here, shall see. I want to be able to see that so I can square up the image. Is that upside down? Right, start the bike. on been sitting for a while oh shit we're nearly out of gas damn it Ah, this is going to be boring then. It's going to be a trip to the bloody gas station. Shit. Sunglasses. Alright, let's just get it set up so it's square. Can't see shit with the sunglasses on. Right. Might have to readjust that. How's my horizon? Well, we can adjust that later. Jog dial. Hey Google. Play Led Zeppelin on Spotify. Ah, oh, no, of course I can't. Oh, yes, I should be able to. Can't connect to Google because I don't get the data. Okay. Come out of that. Go into music. Update music? Hell no. Not now. 
These are summer gloves. Shit, they're flexy. Oh, that's comfortable. Oh, don't send me fucking messages. Right, plug in the Kubra. Should we get a thing from there as well. Morning. I don't think my dash cam's working. Just says drive. It's a quiet helmet. First time in the helmet. I don't want to go and get fuel. I'll test this out. Anything with the music is you can't really hear the motor. I suppose you can, you can feel it, you get a feel for it. It's not as distracting as I thought it might be. It's actually quite nice. Just like driving in the car with it on. Sounds good. Nice and clear. There is better headphone like an aftermarket by Senna set that you can buy high definition speakers apparently are much better than these ones but they seem fine so far oh wow 
just put the uh, visor down. I don't know why some people say that this is a noisy helmet. They've obviously never been in a noisy helmet and have just been spoiled by really good ones. There is no wind noise, mind you, I'm only just cruising. See what happens when we get up a little bit here. Indicate. Probably don't want to hear me singing along. So I wonder if this volume goes up as I put it up. Oh, that's down. Well, that's loud enough. Turn that back down a bit. Beautiful Tauranga. Probably going to sap the battery. I think there's only about an hour's worth of battery available when you're recording. But you can just attach a power supply to it and it will record and charge at the same time. So that's all good. Turn this music down a bit more. Let's have it off right down. Just a little bit in the background. Geez, I don't think I'll bother with the HD speakers. These speakers seem fine. It all depends on what helmet you've got, I suppose. I'll set the gain on the speaker, uh, on the microphone to low. Apparently that, uh, is the best setting for clear. I've also put the audio boost on, it's off by default, I don't know why that is. I could try making a phone call but I won't do that now. I could receive a phone call, that's for sure. Haven't got a tint advisor. But I'm wearing sunglasses that are very comfortable. I can't even feel them. They were a bit foggy when I was sitting still, but on the move they're okay. Oh, here we go. Just whiz down to Bay Park, I think. How much fuel have we got left? I suppose to listen to music, like if you're listening to Rage Against the Machine or something, you might be a bit heavy-handed. You certainly are when you're driving in a car. So I might have to get a chill playlist. Oh shit, I should remember to indicate. Pretty obvious where I'm going, eh? Okay, look at that speedo, it's ridiculous. It only goes to 9 o'clock and, uh, and you're doing the speed limit. It goes up to 3.20. All these gloves are fine. They're a summer glove and I was a bit worried they uh, might not be insulating enough. And, what, and they've got these big air vents and shit in them, so I thought there might be a, a bit of wind come through that you could feel on your fingers and make it uncomfortable. And I thought, oh, should I get glove inners? Or, you know, just wear a nitrile glove or something. 
uh, but not that it's a cold day but but I can't feel anything hey buddy yeah so I don't think my dash cam's working it's very very finicky I might just buy a new one of those they're only about 40 50 bucks just want to plug it in and have it recording all the time also need to clean the front screen somebody's put a uh, registration sticker or something on there and uh, it does block that view a little bit but it is hand oh fuck me look at this all right so that's 80 and there's just no road noise a little bit we got the helmet thing click right down oh, there we go click it New boots are good. Some barrack safety boots. The helmet's got no. It's just so much better than the old helmet. The old helmet was a uh, well, it's an adventure rider's helmet, really. So it wasn't ideal, and it did buff it in the wind a little bit. And this stock screen is fine too. I was thinking about getting one of those bubble screens, so I push the air over the top of you, but firstly they look a bit a bit big, dorky, and take away the sleekness of the bike. And uh, secondly, they're quite an added expense. Well, not that that's the issue, but it's just if it's unnecessary. And if you get the wrong one, well, let's just give us some welly here. You get the wrong one i have heard people say that the uh they actually buff it oh, i'm in sixth they actually buff it into you buff it the air into your face it is kind of buffered into my chest which is nice okay that's 110 that's about all we'll have to, to do we're not a speedster could be do this oh that wind noise is great what's that 120 130 and uh, yeah, that's, I don't even need earplugs. Don't need earplugs for this helmet. Showy NSX, I'm gonna say. Size so small, from a little pinhead. I'm always been a medium, but uh, the guy in the shop said, oh, try the small one. And it, it's just really, really comfortable. I've got nothing pushing on my neck. There's no wind. Oh, here's a guy who's going to overtake me. It's a bit of fun. Always get that on the bikes. It's always somebody who uh, needs to overtake you. Especially when you do it 100. Right, I'm going to uh, get into this lane. And another guy coming up who's going to and overtake me at some point probably just when I need to be in this lane to turn around and we're on 50 oh Jesus this bloody when are they gonna finish a shit don't know if you can hear that music just quiet in the background there Oh jeez, I'm glad I'm in this lane. I'd hate to be filtering through these thin lanes too. In fact, I wouldn't. We could have been sitting there for a long time. I don't know why people don't get in this lane, go right round around about and then carry on. Instead of sitting fucking quarter of a mile back. Oh, nice. Need to turn that up a bit. Indicate. Oop. Um, it's gonna be hard not to sing along.
Twin Deep Nordar bomb. Oh, love that bit of music. Let's turn that down. Hey. Yeah, so you can see the visibility is a bit poor on these mirrors, just in, you can't really see right behind you. So I did um, make up a little camera dash cam thing that I mounted sort of here. And, um, and that was, had a camera out the back, but just with the, the screen, uh, it was just a little bit hard to see. Resolution was fine. Oh shit, what, six gear. Resolution was fine, um, but it was just the glare on the screen was just not ideal, so... Uh, God, I can't believe the lack of wind noise. Oh, 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 oh. oh fuck me, how's our fuel? Ah. Right, need fuel. Where am I going to get fuel? I know. We get some shell 95. In which point I'll probably turn this off. Oh, I've got no pressure points on my head. Jeez, I'm happy with this helmet. And the gloves, much nicer than the other ones. They're flexible. Oh, I've got a bug splat. Right in my field of vision. The car at my bum, size at 100 is not enough for him. Look at that. Ah, that's my office. I have to take this over to the mount and have a look down at the uh, get down pilot bay. Ah, nice. So we're supposed to be going to Gisborne tomorrow, diving. But uh, it's pretty dirty water down there. It's been raining a bit and I expected a bit of rain this weekend, but huh, look at it. It's beautiful. So uh, I won't know until later in the day, in which case I will then have to pack all my shit. Angus and Julius don't, oh these, these speakers are fine, I mean I'm hearing that music, I had to turn it down. When I was doing 120, 130 it was, it was just brilliant. And you do not want to be blasting your ears anyway. The song's a bit louder too, so I'll turn that down again. The old jog dial. Nice. It does drink a bit of fuel. I said it was full when I left Rotorua the other day. I've done, I don't know, three or four trips. Oh, a bit of dicking around, I suppose. It's hard to say. I think you're good for about 350 kilometres. Something like that. One thing that uh, having the music on and talking is that you uh, forget to count your gears so normally in the back of my mind I know exactly what gear I'm in and you should be able to tell by just looking at the revs and the uh, you know the revs, the feel of the bike, the vibration, your speed um, and you know that like you should know when you're in six because uh, that's the easy one you just look at your uh, look at your revs I think it's about 
four and a half at 100k or something I don't know but uh, yeah I'm still clicking to go under seventh which doesn't exist there's the mount see that there's our house unless you haven't park all those trees we're next to that right god knows I'm still even recording I could be fucking sitting there talking to myself and now I have no idea what gear I'm in and it's only about my fourth ride so I haven't got the experience to do that I have uh, ordered a um, little cheat actually I've got a gear indicator coming from Alibaba 25 bucks or something cheap and cheerful but uh, apparently they do work and um, you have to train them you just take the bike for a ride and, and put it in learning mode and it'll learn you know and do all that stuff that you should be working out in your head but uh, I'll just make it easier just so you don't have to think about it hear that car do you hear that probably not it's noise cancelling microphone it's noise cancelling earphone too I think a little bit Fuck me, this bike's going in there too. Ninety five, that'll do us. Why did that suddenly just get louder? Okay, so we'll switch off.